Hey, Glenn, just coming up on the approach now, mate. Hey, Roger that, Hamish, you're coming to the number two road today, over. That is fantastic, you just made my day. I'm glad to have done that for you, Hamish. So just ahead of us here, we've got a lovely big uh, semaphore gantry. Well, they are wooden. What that means is it's all old-fashioned, manually operated metal and wooden signals. All operated from a a room full of manual leave is operated by a proper watch tapping station master. Now the other thing uh, about Corinda is it's well known for its famous gardens. So there's lots of ferns and pot plants and things around the place. Corinda was a routine winner of the uh, interdepartmental railway garden contests that used to run. They started in about 1915 and um, been going uh, pretty much ever since, up until the last sort of decade or so. But still today, Coranda Station is a lovely place. So feel free to enjoy. Now you can go up onto the overbridge in front of the train. You can get photos looking down. Uh, you can go over to the right and have a little bit of a look around down by the river. If you're super, super extra lucky, you may get to spot Elvis, the local cassowary. He might be down there today. But if you want to go up to the cafe, you head straight up to the left at the top of the stairs and then go to the right up the, up the uh, main street into town. But like I said, if you want to head up there now, you can follow Joe. If you want to wait, I'll come up afterwards. Now men, our toilets are just back there behind us. Ladies, you're just in there on the left in the breezeway. Welcome to Coranda. We'll see you back on board, ready to go at 8.45. And we leave through this front left door. Are you going to get a coffee with us?